Welcome to Pensacola, Florida, the site of one of the first European settlement attempts in American history. Over 400 years ago, colonists from Spain first explored and settled the shores of the city's pristine deep water harbor. Led by conquistador Don Tristan de Luna, this settlement attempt in 1559 predates the founding of Jamestown, Virginia, Plymouth, Massachusetts, and even neighboring St. Augustine, Florida. Unfortunately, the settlement failed when a large hurricane destroyed their fleet and the majority of their supplies. The colony was abandoned and Pensacola remained unsettled for over 130 years. But this was only the beginning. Pensacola's history is filled with exciting and significant events and people whose stories and memory are preserved within the city's numerous buildings, sites, and museums. From the age of exploration to the space age, the city of Pensacola has played a critical role in the development of the region, state, and country. Situated between the picturesque coast of the Gulf of Mexico and Escambia Bay to the south, and the rich pine forests of northern Escambia County to the north, the Pensacola metropolitan area is home to over 400,000 people and boasts an economy spurred primarily by the tourism industry and strong ties with the United States military. Beginning in 1698, Pensacola became a central player in the European struggle to control the North American Gulf Coast. During the 18th century, Pensacola changed hands between the Spanish, French, and English several times, lending to the city's most prominent nickname, the City of Five Flags, and the unique cosmopolitan culture that developed here. Florida did not become an American territory until 1821, and Pensacola served as its capital for a brief period of time. Pensacola also played an important role during the early days of the American Civil War. Both sides of the conflict considered the Port of Pensacola to be essential to winning the war, and great efforts were made by each to secure the city and the impressive fortifications that still stand guard over the harbor today. Following the Civil War, Pensacola emerged as a major city in the South, fueled economically by the harvesting of yellow pine timber and red snapper and brick making. Unfortunately, these natural resources were over harvested and the city faced the problem of economic failure. Luckily, the United States Navy began experimenting with a new invention called an aeroplane, and Pensacola was chosen to be the testing grounds and training area for all new Navy pilots, bestowing upon the city a new nickname, the Cradle of Naval Aviation. This choice marked the beginning of a new era in Pensacola and the start of a mutually beneficial relationship that remains active even today. Pensacola's unique history is still very much alive, preserved in its numerous historic neighborhoods and within the walls of its many museums and historic sites. While strolling through the downtown area's historic streets and public parks, visitors to the city can learn more about the area's past at museums such as Historic Pensacola Village, the T.T. Wentworth Jr. Florida State Museum, or the Pensacola Historical Society Museum. A trip to Pensacola Naval Air Station also provides the opportunity to visit the nationally recognized and acclaimed National Museum of Naval Aviation. Beyond just museums, there are also numerous historic sites, including the Pensacola Colonial Archaeological Trail, Fort Barrancas, the Pensacola Lighthouse, and many, many more. Throughout the city's amazing past, Pensacola has been home to Native Americans, Spanish conquistadors, bold European and American settlers, future politicians, sports stars, and even astronauts. The area's rich past has helped to shape the modern development of the state of Florida and the United States as a whole, making Pensacola one of the most historically significant cities in America.